Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So this is about Bangalore Institute of Technology, BIT Bangalore. And what are the different set of documents which are required for KSET and the Comet K admission process. So this is based on, based on students and uh, you know, request. And uh, these are all the set of documents applicable for both the candidates. So let's see first. So uh, you see the first one is the original marks card of 10th and 12th. So actually it's written in the same line, but these are two different documents. 10th marks card original and six photocopies and 12th marks also original and six photocopies so i don't know why six photocopies are required but that is what is mentioned here 10th and 12th class with six photocopies next one is the transfer certificate and the study certificate again you see it is two documents right so transfer tc is nothing but what you get from the your core college and study certificate is you uh, know which is required mostly by the k set students so TC is required for both the students, but case study certificate for seven years is only required for case head student coming from the uh, Karnataka an admission process, right? So one original, six photocopies. Migration certificate is only applicable for non-Karnataka students, as it mentioned. So original uh, migration certificate has to be submitted along with six photocopies. Aadhaar card, only six Xerox and photocopy sets are to be provided. Three passport size photographs are there I would say six uh, copies also then one of the exam you would have come is the CET exam or the Comet K so you have to produce either the CET allotment letter or the Comet K allotment letter again here one original and six photocopy sets are what is requested next one is the caste certificate and income certificate again the students who are bringing getting from different caste category right if they are claiming that category quota then they have to bring the caste certificate in the government format and similarly students who are coming uh, you know based on snq or some other income levels are defined so you income certificates again these two are required for cet students only and for HKR students of you know Comed K, this is also required. So HKR students will have to produce additional certificate which is uh, for their uh, eligibility criteria. So one original and six photocopies. And last one is the you see undertaking form which is not there in any other college, but it mentioned that undertaking form on the hundred rupees bond paper by both student and guardian signed by notary so i don't know what is this undertaking form which is required as is mentioned on their website for what purpose it is we don't know so maybe you may not be able to produce it since the purpose is not mentioned right so that is what the six seven eight documents which are mentioned on their website right now so you will have to see other details if you get any mail from the college so that's all I have to cover in this video. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe channel to get similar important updates. Take care.